We're going to be monks and necros. All right. All right, guys. Here we are. Heading into Upper Gut. Welcome back to the Self Found Friends group. We got a nice full group. We got Classic on his Ranger. And we got Wolfdar on uh, Korvac. And we've got. Um... Oh, this is the way his corpses aren't here anymore. Uh oh. She's, she's on Teak now. <laughs> we got uh, Throbbit on his rogue. We got our new friend Nightwatch. He's now 31. We got we got Jethika on the yeah Jethika Throbbit's rogue. And who am I forgetting? I feel like I'm forgetting somebody. Classic on the Ranger. Yeah, that covers it. Yeah, we're going to Ghoulbane. Now let me turn up the volume for everyone else so you can hear the the talk. Of course, we got me and my shaman as oh, well. There's a mage clearing out. A little area right here. So hopefully you see a mage. <laughs> I hope I know where I'm going. I think I'm going the right way. I'm at the ladder drop down. I already uh, went down the ladder. Okay. Um, Does everybody know where they're going still? Nope. I'm over by that uh, that camp we did a long time ago. With the stairs and the got the golden rod thing. Yeah, I'm there too. So we are all in Viz and we can't see each other. Just wait here. I don't know. What if it drops, you know? There. Yeah, if it drops and we're all scattered like this. So where do we meet up? Yeah. I just I just dropped down the hole, the ladder. Okay. So it's left. Yeah. It's left from there. I'm at the entrance to the uh, mushrooms. Oh shoot, I must have gone the wrong way. Yeah, I have no idea where that ever been I... there. I'm lost. Oh no, I'm scared. Where do I go? What do you see? Well, can you tell me, like, I have a map, so if you can tell me, like, do I head northeast, north, like, where is it on well, the map? Well, it's, it's like east. Okay. East. Okay. East-ish? Yeah, well, I'm pointing straight at the, you know, it just depends on which which way you're headed down the tunnels, I guess. If, you get, oh, if you're at that camp where we were, that's already too far. Oh, yeah? Uh-oh. Okay, I'm kind of coming back. Is there a room where there's three different ways to go right before that priest camp? And you're supposed to go on the left one. I think you went on the right one. Oh, I just found the uh, lower gux zone line. Yeah, it's way too far. I'm at the mushrooms too. No, the usual one, not the live side one. The the usual lower gux. Uh, <laughs> that's on, on the wrong side of the zone, I guess. So we need to go to the west side of the zone then. Yeah, I'm I'm back over that first place that we were camping. That's where I ended. Oh, I mean, gosh. supposedly my character's facing east, so I don't know. Uh, okay, now I'm back at the stairs by the Scryer camp. You said that was already too far as well? The Scryer? The stairs, you're at the stairs by the Scryers? I think it's, no, not the Scryer, sorry. The the guy who drops the golden mask, I think. Yeah, the priest. I'm still going, yeah. I'm just going back. I can hear you running around me. I can hear you running around me. Go back towards like the entrance, and then you'll be in a room that has three, well, oh, four directions, I guess. I think my memory just turned on. I think I know where to go. Okay, so if there's four in that room with three or four ways to go, coming back. Yeah. Where do you go? When you're coming back, you want to go two to the right. <laughs> if that makes sense. So the, the far door, the far hall on the right. Oh, I yeah. think I found it. Yep, okay. Oof. Thank God they did not drop. Do any of these see invis, these I, mushrooms? I think you guys are here now, right? No. I just no, dropped into nothing. Mushroomville. Nothing to see everybody here. here. Yeah. I'm, uh, 
I'm over at this the safe pillar spot, and Wolfdar knows what I'm talking about. Reddo's okay, here. I see, I see mushroom. Yeah, I'm here. Okay. Bumping into somebody invisible. Should we just fight from here, or what do you want to do? Just come to the safe spot. There's a little uh, pillar right there where it transfers from the frogs. When you to drop the, down I mean, into the mushrooms, the mushrooms the turn frogs. right. And go, there. go to the frogs, and you'll see a pillar. Yeah, just Yeah, I hear people walking around here. I think we can uninvis if you're hugging the pillar. You can uninvis and not not be within sight. So I'm going to do that. I'm standing, I'm standing just outside the mushrooms. I see a fungus soldier, two fungus breeders. Just turn right and come down here. You'll see yeah, us. We're on the other side of the pillar. I see you. I see Ong Shaft. Pippy long shafts. That being dong, dong shaft. Oh. All right, I'm here. Who's All right. Tanking, Pappy, I'm assuming. No, maybe night watch. I mean, he is uh, an SK technically. Let's see whoever gets the aggro. You guys fight for tankage. Consider it a battle. I'm I'm setting I'm setting up an assist key. Who's who's gonna be tanking? Set up. Uh, we'll have it. Tank tank. Probably me. Yeah. Even though Pappy's. Alright, I'll use an assist key too. Being all responsible and stuff. Assist Night Watch. So here we are, you guys. Um, we made it. We're gonna burn our way into the ghoul room. Alright, maybe I'll start with a root. Was, does that sound like an idea? And then uh, kill the shaman first. I guess, right? Or that works. Nice. How the heck did you single pull that? That's ridiculous. Yeah, the, the others are green. Oh, holy yeah. crap. Oh, because I'm not... Yeah, you're higher than me. Nice. Very nice. And you're not going to see a lot of XP on this, because a lot of this is going to be green to the higher level. That's fine. Uh, once we yeah, get I'm in there, yeah, a little bit. All right, so I forgot that um, we got some higher levels with this. Fappy is 30 or 31. Let's see. Fappy's 31. The SK is 31. The Rogue is 33. So we're going to be able to do some nice single pulling for now, but soon, when we get to the, the proper spot, things should get a little tougher. Oh yeah, gotta do stuff. I'm, uh, I'm going to throw some snares on, too. We'll scroll butt in the way. Here we go. There's one in the back. Oh, he dies so fast. The green. So here we go. So through this room, after we kill this guy and then the next patrol, I think we're going to be into the XP area. These mobs are too low for us. So really, this is just technically for the solo self-found thing. I won't well. do anything. <laughs> and we kill him one time and I say, oh, look. It's in an invisible ghoul bane, and then I'll just get mine out of the bank. <laughs> <laughs> I'm okay if we end up not getting a ghoul bane, and then we pretend like we did. And I'm saying this on camera, so I really am shameless about that I am here. decision. I am here. here for the lulls. I mean, I've, I've, camped, I've camped this thing for like four hours before. Dude, you, that's just horrible bad luck, I think. I came here on my cleric on P99, and I 
I got it. I did kill the like three or four times, like a couple placeholders and a couple of the lords, and I got it relatively quick. Alright, the experience is starting to flow. Not on that one though. Let me make sure my camera's alright. Yeah, it's good. It's pretty up close. This this headset always looks lopsided. Oh, it's because I'm I forgot it's mirrored, and I keep trying to adjust it, and I adjust it incorrectly. <laughs> there we go, that looks better. I hit this one with an envenomed breath. Boom. There we go. Look, I got the aggro with my nice big fatty fat dot. Let's throw a heal out there. Alright, and now we gotta do some canny dancing. And then I think we're gonna need to throw a regen on ourselves here now. What do you think the lowest level Jethka can get XP with? Oh shoot, you're right. Oh. Someone Everyone might already be there. Scared. Really? I I didn't think of this as a possibility. Well, what are we going to do if Ghoulbane's camped? That's a bummer. I didn't even think of that. Probably I don't know where to go from here. Something. I'm officially lost. Who's lost? You just clear out this whole room. This is kind of like just a room. Oh. Bunch of bunch of little mini rooms. That body makes me think Ghoulbane's camped for sure. Like why else would someone be here? Yeah. Well in that case we'll have to think about what else there might be to do in the zone. Every time I've th I thought I found it open, somebody comes out of being invis and goes like, Hey, I'm camping this. <laughs> Jesus. Just pooping all over our socks. Yeah, there's a SK right here. Okay. Oh, it's an SK. He's red too. Sorry buddy, you're not in level range for XP, so that means you have to leave the camp. <laughs> that would be a good thing. They all right. just put that all over the place. It's like you can't loot anything, you know, like in the in the uh, event zone. You can't loot anything if you're too high level. Yeah, that would be kind of cool. Then the low bees could make money selling the items to the high bees, you know. Maybe. Non-trivial loot code, yeah. No, uh, no one would play on the crew if that were the case. <laughs> Just go farm plat and then buy it off the lo people who are level in there, you know? But yeah, they probably would not play. I farm plat by farming this and selling it. <laughs> I like farming raw plat, I don't mind. Probably not the most efficient, though. Yeah, it seems to work for me, especially when the XP is good. Like, I cannot beat those sisters in Butcher Block, the XP. Like, I went to try Soul B. I did a, a pair in Soul B. I got 1% for killing two mobs. And I'm getting, like, 2.5% uh, per pair in um, Butcher Block. And they're easier. But it's bugged right now. One of the sisters is missing, and the other sister is looking the wrong way at the ruins. Uh, number three on the butcher block map and uh, first i thought you know is there an enchanter charming one of them and using it 
Um, but that didn't explain why the other one was looking the wrong way, and it also didn't explain how I logged on for an entire week. Every time I checked, it was that was the case. And then I looked it up, and apparently it's a problem. Like it gets bugged out. I'm surprised they haven't repopped the zone yet. I was in Lower Guck yesterday, and uh, one of the GMs came in there, and they like warned us in five minutes I'm repopping the zone. Huh. And then in five minutes they repopped the zone, and I think it was to fix missing mobs or something. Yeah, it makes sense. So they, they were like getting they get in a safe re spot. Whatever's up, they they repop it back to the spot. Like they just get more back. Like I was sitting in front of Evil Eye because that's a safe spot for me, and then suddenly Evil Eye turned into a Shaman Frog Lock, so I knew the deed was done. But it repopped the entire room that I had cleared. Which was nice. Uh, he's in my guild. He said he was just passing through. I, he might be leaving soon. So just oh. Hard. oh, nice. Just nice. passing through on the way to... Yeah, he says, uh, y'all can have it. Uh, I checked PH's gun in and out. Uh, yeah, so he's, he's out. Oh, he's just like, while I'm passing through, I'll see if I can grab a Google Bane. Yeah. I used to do that. Nice. All right, so it looks like we're back in business, boyos. We're back in business. Nice guy. Yeah, he was on his way to lower cut, so he was just checking to see if mobs were up. So I don't know if... You guys saw, you probably did. My hardcore paladin died. I've only loaded three ghoul banes so far today. I got totally ever requested. Totally ever requested. Had the mob down to 6%, I had 26, and he beat me. And I, I was right next to the zone line, so I'm like, well, if it gets below 20, no matter how much HP the mobs got, I should just zone it. But then, you know, I was like, you know what? I refuse to get ever requested. And I think part of it was. I was losing my, I was losing my enjoyment of playing the hardcore character. It was looking like it was just going to be a grind, a bunch of wisps, and then grind a bunch of sashes off bandits, and then I made him solo, yeah, self found. It was like in, Sal, in my region. <laughs> do you, oh, you don't have a strength buff? Okay, I can do the strength buff. No, you yeah. don't have to. Dude. Fine. Right. No, definitely should do that. Down. I forgot about that. Just I know, but the last one is kind of true. That guy. Well, when we're in lower gut, having a strength buff means I, I'm either hitting or I'm not hitting. Because everything's like yellow and red. But here it's like green, light blue, some dark blue. So I can just push it this one. I keep hearing people th who say like dex buffs are not even worth it. What do you guys think? Dex is. If you're trying to get weapon skill ups, that's where it's at. So. Is anybody trying to get weapon skill ups? Let me know. Nah, I think I'm a cat. Well, let's see if it helps your hit rate. I mean, it's not going to hurt anything except your mana. Yeah, my mana's doing good. Rock stuff, but. Oh, we got an ad back here. Oh, I need to, uh. I need to do it on myself. Because I just started using the spear. I need to level it up. This is, this is the perfect time to level up my spear. There we go. Speak of the devil, went up to 45. I'm rooted right now. Cool, we're getting fed repops. Yeah. Not all of them give XP. Maybe we should move into the room. What level is your shaman? 25. But we, Jethka's 33, so... Yeah, there's even green ones to me. Yeah, if we go if we go into this room, I think in the room, we should be good. Right yeah, let's pull him out. We got another pop in here too. It's all gonna pop right now. So um 
Yeah, maybe chill here and then maybe after. Clear it one more time. After we clear it, it. yeah. That one's rooted, but I guess it doesn't matter. Uh oh. They're both rooted. Maybe move in after this one. I don't have split on because I figure everyone like me doesn't want a bunch of copper. Hope that's alright. I, no, I want you to have as much copper as I can give you. These probably don't even drop a plat, so... And then if they do, some whoever loses it gets them, it. Some of them do, and I'm just... You know, I'm just pulling the coin. If y'all want me to stop, I'll stop. I don't give a shit. This room over here only has one spawn, and I remember it being in a group that camped over here before. This is a high level spawn though, but it's still only one spawn. Yeah, he's one. Hey yo. There he is. Speak of the devil. So yeah. The solo self found hardcore adventure is over. And you know, I'm not that disappointed that it's over, to be honest. Do you remember how last week these things were it was fun. to me? Yeah. Now you're yeah. eight levels higher. Ten, ten levels higher. The experience bonus is helping offset the light boost. Like actually, or just psychologically? Psychologically. I'm not really. I'm not really paying attention to. <laughs> I have gotten about maybe ten percent since we got. Oh, nice. I don't think I have, but maybe I'm just not remembering what I had before correctly. Yeah, I got like a decent. Uh... Mountains being here. Huh. I must resist it, my bad. It is moving, but I'm wondering if it just moves when we kill Dark Blue. <laughs> Got right. 14 levels on Teak last night. <laughs> We're getting like 5% of the kill or something. Jeez. <laughs> Ridiculous. Anybody bust a group pot, group XP pot? Nah, everybody running pots, so there wasn't no group ones though. The make friends potion. <laughs> I got like 50 chrono or some shit on, <laughs> on live ever, or TLPs, whatever, on EverQuest. I gotta play another one one of these days. It's just like sitting there. This is the one then, dude. Apparently. Uh, I'm not, Apparently, I uh, personas. Like that, but I don't. It is the one, though, to like blow your money if that's. Yeah. Apparently, yeah. But maybe it just feels that way because it just launched. And it's a special anniversary and whatnot. And it's. But it is, though, because it's a mischief rule set. So it really is the one. So they, um. Yeah. They, uh, uh, the EverQuest 2 TLP is in beta right now, and it's, um, it's a no chrono server. Um, so if it does well, I'm thinking maybe they'll do an EverQuest 1 server, no chrono. 
which I thought they'd never nice. do. But I also thought they'd never start in Kunark either, because that's a bunch of money that they're leaving out as well. Um, so I don't know. I mean, shoot, if they do an EverQuest 1 server with no Chrono, that might line up perfectly with one to kind of dabble in. Do you think I should be slowing? No. Yeah, it's too Unless fast. You're, right? having you're having trouble healing, start slowing, but I think we're doing okay. I might even, even if I was having trouble healing, I think they're dying fast enough where it would end up maybe yeah. costing more mana than it's worth. So much mana. Yeah. So bad. The, the Persona thing is the big thing sale on there, I think. The which one? The Persona, where you can oh, change yeah. classes. That's on Teak? Yeah. So, so everyone can just run a bard up to max level and then change to whatever class they want. I think it's limited on what you can change to, but yeah. My friend linked me a post. It wasn't Teak. It was some other server, but somebody had like a bunch of different epics on the same character. Because <laughs> of the, I think, because of the Persona thing, I think. Yeah, I I didn't even got the Lorian song expansion or anything. After I've like two years, they just give it to you free, right? You're just missing like the last latest two for that works. Yeah, yeah. You know what you should do, Classic? Later, I think it's when Pop drops, that's when they're going to open up the ability to get a heroic level 50. And then maybe that's when you try Teak. You know? If you're maybe. feeling it. Or just skip the mess. But if the experience is that good, you might as well just level the character at that point. I don't even want to play there, to be honest. <laughs> like, okay. It's all theoretical. I feel like you do want to play there, and you're like fighting it, like you're suppressing it. I feel like deep inside, you want to play there. It's, it's really good if you, pretty, you know, my, I don't have a lot of time to play because you can get your loot. I'm looking forward to the the Ixars. That's gonna be fun. Speaking of which, let's let's talk about that. And I'm just okay. kidding. I'm just kidding, Matt. I know you don't really want to play there because uh, this server is the best. Yeah. Right. And uh, yeah, this yeah. is this. You just follow it because you're like uh, you're kind of like a grandpa at the newspaper. I think I don't think you really want to play. You're just like, oh, the new new TLP. You know, hmm, what's this going on what's here? What's on sale this week? Yeah, what coup what coupon's gonna find in the penny saver? No, oh, that's grandma. Sorry, Our not grandma. Egg, egg, the penny egg, saver. Egg. Grandpa's watching Our the stocks. <laughs> yeah, though next week is uh is Kunark launch. So yeah, nice. This is the time, dude. I'm I'm really like 90% to SK, but you know, I was thinking I could also do, I could do Necro or Monk or Warrior as well. Or just anything but Shaman. Anything but Shaman. Just well, make whatever you want. I say everybody makes what they want, and then yeah. um, we'll just make do with what we have. And buy bandages. You can, you can run a group. You can run a group all monks. It's fun. Yeah, just, if you have aggro, feign death, and then somebody else tanks. Yeah, with men. Pass yeah. shit around, now Robin. Yeah. And if you die, it's more fun. Just go back to your shit. And it's, at least it's content for you two. You guys are doing that. Yeah, that and with the XR... Ix, yeah, I mean we could even be all we could be all any of those classes, actually. Like, literally. Even if we were all warriors with bandages, like, and taunt, you know, passing taunt around. With that region, dude, we should what just all be. XR region. We should just all be necros. <laughs> it would be so cool to watch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> It'd just be a swarm of pets. Like we wouldn't Let's even do be it. casting. Let's do it. Everybody's <laughs> necros. Let's do it. No, I think Matt couldn't do it again. Not... Yeah, yeah, he couldn't. Do it. He can be the necro shaman. overload. Yeah, he can be the shaman. <laughs> That's what I was gonna say. <laughs> no, he can be the monk. Oh, he goes and pulls. Pain. Let him be the monk. He goes and pulls him in. Okay. I then we'll all still have feigned death at least. 
Yeah. Uh, names reserved for every class. Is um, is the last one I want. Like I know we're having a sequence is doing a thing in a few days for the Kunar thing. On the thirty first, right? Oh the Q and A? Yeah. Oh, pop yeah. here. I'm gonna root it. I'm gonna root it. Uh Okay. Is there any idea what would be legacy then? Or Yeah. Oh good arc, yeah. We know already. Oh, see. I don't I don't know. So. Yeah, it's legit legacy stuff, um, pretty much already. But they're adding some to it. Uh, basically, the fungi tunic and staff is kind of a legacy thing now. And then I actually went to a stream and tried to clarify that, or I did clarify it a little bit. Because uh, in the post, he doesn't mention the 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 fungi tunic and staff that have a zero point two percent chance to drop off of any fungi in the zone. Um, it doesn't mention that that's going to be legacy, but it is going to be legacy. So either way, it's going to be legacy. Just the one that drops off the boss, you have to be level 50 to loot. The other ones, you can loot at any level and it's tradable. The boss one, uh, no drop. So if you want it and you're level 50, just walk in there and get it, basically. But if you want one, you can put on an alt. You have to farm the fungi people and walking around the zone and down the halls and shit. And man, it's going to be so packed. It's going to be hilarious. <laughs> Is that the staff yeah. or the tunic? Both. The, the fungi tunic, like legit looted, is gonna be no drop. Yeah, if you loot it legit style, you have to be level fifty and it's no drop. But they're adding it to the loot table of any fungus, zero point two percent chance, and it's tradable. It's still legacy. You can only loot one, so that should help clear it out. Hopefully, it's gonna take a while. So that, so that, that means there will be some that are that are on the market. Yeah. So, okay. Yeah, um, but what do you want, Nightwatch? Whatever that is going to be down there. Yep. Yeah. Well, I was thinking that's about... Kinda why, that's kind of why I rolled this road, because everybody needs a road in fucking seven. So. Yeah. Big pocket of fun now. Yeah, I was thinking about tweaking a monk, and I was like, oh, I wonder how I'm going to get a fungi. Yeah, yeah they're going to be expensive for a little bit. Yeah. Uh, but you will want the uh, Circle of Shadow. Um, which should, I actually, by the looks of it, it's not going to be that expensive. They're going to keep it pre-nerfed the whole time. And it drops off of anything in that zone. But uh, that, that way you can feign death and invis. Yeah, the pre-nerf one is... All of them you can, I think, but the pre-nerf one is the zero, is like the insta-cast. Yeah, it's an insta-cast uh, invis. Yeah, but you, I think you have that, the post-nerf, you, you actually have to equip it. All I know is it takes a second, and that ruins it anyways. Stand up, and then you die. <laughs> <laughs> and the goblin ring, it's gonna be, it's gonna be fun trying to get that. Yeah. That's All not the enchanters. Is he gonna make that legacy? Because if that's just like regular legacy, that would be too bad. I don't remember, but people are going to want also um, moss covered twigs. If he keeps it in. Yeah, it's all pre nerf. Everything is staying pre nerf. Everything. But, but they're. Job. There's going to be like no loot restrictions and legacy things and all that. So yeah, I'm 90% to SK. Yeah, I'm gonna make them long for sure. Yep, I'm making all of them, but probably focus on the long. And I'm gonna, SK. and uh, I think I'm gonna make a necro too. But like for us grouping, I'm it's gonna be SK for sure. Necro's okay, gonna be good. for dueling with Wolfdar. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna do Charmin for sure. I was thinking about it, and no, I already have my name reserved for my shaman. Good, because we could really use a shaman or two, or even three. I think. I'm worried about not having enough shamans. Like when we group. So we're there for a month. I don't know who is planning know. on getting how high well, in a month. Right. Uh, uh, <laughs> Shin Lord's up, but he's not harder than the sword. 
Oh, okay. Well, if we get nice. high enough, we probably need to kind of raid um, down. Raid what? Get the Dalner, mm. especially for monkey or like crescent farm. I actually don't have high aspirations. I just trying. I just want to be in my like mid to late twenties by the end of the month. Yeah. Nice yeah, touch. I'm low on mana. I rooted the Shin Warrior over there, I but maybe split tank it if it breaks. I'll just um, go in first. I think. I have 100 percent health. Yeah, maybe go over and start battling the warrior soonish. Let me tell you, it's got 20 seconds left on gold, but it could come off at any time. Okay. Nice, good job, guys. Um. Gonna have, to do it. gonna have to do it without lay on hands next time. Yeah. Okay, I just started a timer a little late. All right, let's see what we got. We got a silver-plated bracer. Not something we can wear. Is that an upgrade, Korvac? Oh, yeah. All right, time to start candy dancing. So, yeah, we're looking forward to... Yeah, yeah, I don't know. Looks like that would be a upgrade, yeah. Grab I don't know. I don't know what level I'll be by the time that month's up, but I plan on like playing on the SK as much as, as much as I can. You know. You know my night little night I sessions. Mean, I mean I'm having a blast as an SK. I think I'm gonna enjoy it. Yeah, you can you can work on all the whole green as too, so it's good Yeah. Show. Uh, yeah, I need to do that. Someone was telling me about that the other day. I also need to go get the soul uh, armor. Dark mist or whatever it's called. If I end up finishing the wizard to 50 before Kunark drops, I'll probably have nothing else to do but to play that monk, though. <laughs> so you're going to cruise? I might. I mean, who knows? I don't know what... The, and we're going to be restricted because there's going to be so many people there, too. Yeah. Just be like, you know, log in, be like a log out. <laughs> right. That's another thing to think about. But I don't know. There's, uh, there's camps There's camps for XP and Swamp and No Hope, especially if there's more than one person maybe. I bet we could get we could get a little clever. I mean, there's some like lower level mobs in like worse looks woods, you know. I think everyone's gonna be in field of bone. Oh, but yeah. field of bone, and then like all four of the of the zones connecting to Catalyst have newbies in. Pop in here. They're gonna be Lake of the Lumen, and they're gonna be field of bone, and then everyone will be at the at the giant fort in Barzo. Can't wait for somebody to figure out how to get their XR to the mainland. <laughs> Before the... <laughs> yeah. Someone's going to figure it out. Like be swimming in, swimming in the ocean to, to towards the zone line. I mean, the barge is in here. And early on, I took the barge, and it tele when it goes to zone, it teleported me <clears throat> like to the middle of like Orc Highway. And then it like rebound me there somehow. Like, oh my god! Know. It's like it punishment. Weird. Punishment for trying. When I logged off, it the binding me there like got removed. But 
for like that session. If I died, it put me there, or if I like gated, it put me there. That's that sounds like an intentional programming thing. But maybe not. Oh shit. That's funny though. Should have had that on video. That would have been a good little video. Yeah. Classic, give us a good uh, good lead on when you've got to log. That way we can start working our way out since we can't support out. Sure. Probably about an hour, but in about 30 minutes, I'm going to hit up my work and kind of see if I really need to go in or not. It's like... There was like, they were thin last night, and then there was like call outs and stuff. So they tried to get me to go in last night, and I was like, no. And then of course they come back with because everyone went drinking. Probably. So then they came back with, what well, can you go in tomorrow morning? And I was like, Jesus. And I was like, well, I have some time between. Well, I'm busy in the morning, and I'm busy a little later in the day, but I can go in for a half or in the middle, and then. Uh, but I was like, man, what if it's just not even busy by the time, 12 hours from now, by the time I need to go in? I think you should just Summon. not answer your phone next time. Okay. Yeah, I know, but my work's going through some weird shit right now, so I'm trying to yeah. not get caught up in waves of layoffs and stuff, even though I don't deserve it. There's, there's like a lot of politics and stuff going on. The whole I have nine years tenure with the company, but we got absorbed, so I'm still like the new guy to them, kind of thing. Yeah. The excuse they have to get rid of you because if you've been there for nine years, you make more money than a new hire would. Yeah. Yeah. Plus they they moved our people into another pharmacy's people, and that pharmacy isn't gonna fire their or lay off their own people. They're gonna lay off the people who just got there six months ago even though we've been with the company technically like nine years or whatever and that's what's been happening everybody who's been laid off came from my pharmacy there's not been a single person who is existing at the current pharmacy i mean they got bought too just like we did but a year ago and we're in their building so they have like home court advantage and we have their management my management's gone my old management's gone and all us that's little worker I, bees that's how they do it they, they didn't buy they didn't buy them for the workforce. They bought them for the customer base. Yeah, exactly. But then we're under the control of a year ago <laughs> was a competing pharmacy. We were competing pharmacies, and then they bought both of us. They bought them first, though. So they trained them all and got them all good going. And then when they bought ours a year later, they're like, all right, we're either going to um, demote your uh, management or just kick them out and then move all the workers over. But this other place has been there already before they were bought a year ago. And we got moved over. So we're like, I don't know. They just look at us like differently. It's weird. It's like two guilds, you know, they're both been raiding. One of them breaks up, you absorb them. You know, they're always and now. You got to like put them into your raid and mix all the raiders together. But you've already been raiding with your guild for years. You know, you're just going to be like, this guy's getting this loot? What? He just got in our guild. But it's like, yeah, but <laughs> you know what I mean? It's just really weird. I don't know what the respawn time is on the Lord, but it's hitting about eight minutes right now on the clock. Yeah, he can be a little off sometimes. Frog lock, shit lord. B frog lock, shin lord. Lower case nice. Two. I landed a dot on him. Yeah, just keep the timer going so I can... Yeah. I want to try to keep that room split. It seems like it was right. Did you see it spawn? Or was he already up? Yeah. Nice. No, I've seen it. It's right in front of me. So I was, it was right on. It's eight minutes then. 
I guess I could watch track. I guess. No need. I got the timer, baby. Honey buns. Another bracer if you want it. Oh, you want to double up? All oh, that. Oh, yeah. I mean, he's disease self resist. so he'll, he needs it more than I do. Yeah. 10 disease, 10 I'm poison sure resist. Kill him another. He's going to be a shaman killer now. Probably kill him another half dozen times. Oh, I forgot to start the timer. Damn it. It's probably only a minute behind. It's, it's not like we're searching Get a pickpocket skill up. That never happened. Since we talked about XP the last time, I have gotten like 13%. Nice, yeah. I've, yeah, I've probably gotten about 24. 48 to 64 for me. Oh, yeah. I gave you guys a shout out on the stream last night. You streamed? No, I was on Variety Void stream last night. Oh. Yeah, I was playing with him and Ion Blaze. Oh, nice. I just watched their little TLP videos. I miss yeah, Rekt you. Somebody, somebody was saying they recognized maybe they couldn't place me. I said, well, probably is in one of Classics or Cinder's videos. And they're like, who's Sendrith? What's <laughs> <laughs> the channel, man? I'm trying. We got, we got a, a repot back here. I saw the mage on one of his alts, and Ion Blaze did a video about like a terrible time in unrest. They're at a fireplace group, and they he dies a couple times, and they have to train the zone a few times. Freaking the mage is in that. In his group in that video. <laughs> I think he's on his rogue on P99. Do you mean right now? No, I mean in that video. The video uh -huh. took place on P99. It's Island Blaze's video. And uh, the mage is on his rogue. I'm so sorry. I forgot about not chewing gum on video, you guys. I apologize. Yeah, that's where we started out last night, the fireplace, and then we ended up at the uh, assassin supplier at the end. Damn, it's quick. Alright, Marlax is okay. Yeah, I'll put on pause until he gets back. I'll top people off while we wait for him. All right, I'm back. So, um, about the Ixars again. It's gonna drop on Saturday. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah, in the middle of the day. The servers are coming down at noon. So that's what. That's my Friday night? Is that right? I think so. No. Yeah. Oh, no. no. Your Sunday? No. Sunday. no, I'm ahead. Sunday. I'm ahead. It'll be Sunday morning. Sunday morning for you. If it's dropping on your Saturday, then it's I'm ahead. Like, oh, yeah, yeah you're Sunday. right. Okay, yeah, so Sunday. Okay. Sunday morning. Oh. But probably around like 2 a.m. <laughs> for you. Yeah. yeah. So more like Monday. 
So it'd be like, uh, oh, it'd be like at the tail end of my Xbox session, I just log on to EverQuest instead of going to bed. Got to take a nap so you can pull an all-nighter. That's what I got coffee for. You're right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I had a hard time going to sleep last night. It has it all hopped up on Mountain Dew. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about Mountain Dew, baby. Spider monkey. Actually, I was hopped up on Sun Drop. We don't drink Mountain Dew around here. What about Mellow Yellow? Yeah, I, well, I don't buy Coke anymore, but yeah, I used to drink Mellow Yellow. They don't have that out here, but I've got a family that? around the United States to is it, know Is that it. something you usually drink when you're doing Coke or something? Oh, oh, but I'm gonna fight it with the mellow or what? Oh, yeah, I guess so. Got to mellow down. <laughs> or splurge. That, that was splurge. The back in the 90s. Oh, yeah, it's been a long time. That surge, yeah. Oh yeah, it was, oh, it was surge, it was surge, surge, yeah. I just well, remember what the can looked like. There, there's another one called Squirt. It's like, I, I don't want to be caught drinking that. <laughs> Squirt's good. Oh yeah. It? Squirt's actually pretty good. Yeah. I don't like that ruby, ruby red squirt, but I like the original. You heard it here, folks, guys. <laughs> you heard it here, folks. Squirt's actually pretty good. I just I hate the name of it, but it's really good. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> A necro spell splurt. <laughs> he splurt me. Sounds like something that should have steps to screw in the time. The place that we should spark here in a second. Oh, so bad. So secrets again for the second time. Ever. Might be the third. <laughs> She's like, uh, she was saying, oh yeah, we we're gonna the the guards can't be charmed thing is just supposed. To, oh, the ghoul lords probably pop in any second. By the way, the guards can't be charmed thing is mostly was an accident, so we're probably gonna fix that. And it's like, when are you actually gonna fix it? Because, you know, it's like... Like a fucking... It'll be a year in three months. Like, when Classic's done yeah. and it doesn't matter as much. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's like... Well, it'll still matter. They're doing so many little changes all the time. She's doing all this... It's like, this is a huge thing. Like, an entire class is crippled from what, the, what mobs they can kill. You know? It's like... I thought it was done on purpose so that there wasn't, but, like, shenanigans or something. But, I mean, like... Uh, they already have really high magic resistance. I think that's enough for, you know, balancing it out. Yeah. 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 And she said, like, it was an accident. She said it, like, three times. And it's like, oh, yeah, we got to fix that. It's like, get a notepad and write this stuff down. <laughs> Stop paying you for nothing. <laughs> right? I'm not getting my money's worth here. Dude, I feel like I'm in like uh, East Common Lands. I've seen any mesh armor for sale. Looking for port to tox. It's like what the heck? You're playing that wizard? I didn't even realize. Like I'm just out. I'm in like zones trying to level and stuff, and people are just constantly spamming me Not for ports and stuff. If you ever go, if you ever take roller and on off, it, it, you just get inundated. Like immediately. It's actually pretty crazy. This is way worse than I imagined. It's because dial is like non existent. Yeah. I see them advertise here or there, and then you slash who them, there's two people. Yeah, I even, usually. Even when there's more on, there's still people just get through it. There's not an on? Oh, well, you must be porting. Right. Like I'm sitting in Riverdale, forget that I'm 
not and on, and all of a sudden someone's like, hey, can you come and get me? Um, I'm in guck. Yeah, no. <laughs> I have kicks now, I just got them. Or punts. So, it's not as bad actually, but you don't get them until 44. Uh, That's why I'm anonymous all the time, 24-7. Yeah. yeah, I just put roll on and just forgot about it on on the of it. it. When I hit fifty, I was like, "Oh, cool, level 50. And I took took it off for a minute. I was like, "Yeah, no, fuck this." <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking forward to being able to port. I've never been able to port before. Leave anonymous off. I can't port yet. <laughs> it doesn't matter. <laughs> People don't know that. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be funny. No, I'll start picking up once you Pop. get like into your thirties. I thought of a way to power level with the enchanter. Like I the charm thing. You just do that and just then break your pet? Yeah, break and let the let the lobby kill the mobs. Uh I was getting power leveled by Necro last night and it was interesting. Cause they were uh health packing and then they were twitching me when I needed mana. Huh. I thought they were maybe fading. Well, no, and then uh, I did all the work, and then like when the mob got about like twenty, twenty-five percent, they would send the pet in, and the pet would like just finish it off, and I was to get all like all the experience. They could do that technically at like forty-eight percent, right? And you should still get full experience, isn't that right? Uh, I think so. Sure. As long as you do, if you do fifty-one percent, yeah. Yeah. You do a mem wipe. But then it takes you longer to kill it, probably. I mean, you could get it down to like 5% and do a mem wipe on the bomb. Necros have mem wipe too? There's so many corpses. Way too much work. Yeah. yeah. So I got two levels on my wizard, and um, I used, I think, seven out of ten charges of my sow pot. So I uh, need to buy another one or two to get to 20, probably. What level is your wizard now? 18. Yeah. Not bad. I really tried to... We're doing 28% XP an hour in here. Mine says 37, but yeah, I'm lower than you. That's pretty good. Yeah. I think I came in at eleven percent, sit to forty percent. So, considering I'm what my the highest level in the group today. I yeah, I think out. so. A lot of light blues and stuff. So. I mean, I got a whole yellow so far, so it hasn't been that bad. So I've got about twenty percent. This is the highest camp in the zone, right? Yeah, for uh, most. Yeah. I've been looking. How are those backsteps? What's your biggest tonight so far, Jeff? Uh, I think I saw 150 ish somewhere. Oh, okay. Maybe 160, 170. I'm just looking to see if they hit. It's too fucking random to be worthwhile. Still fun. Bad thing. The, the more I play the road, the more I just want to play a monk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's how I feel. Look. 
I and I didn't even play I it yet. Trying, I was trying to level up uh, Find Wound, and then I find out that it, it caps at 175 for rogues until like level 57. Oh, jeez. Just a month. Just a month. On P99, they changed it to where warriors and and rogues at, at 51 can go to 201, but the way it's supposed to be is level 57. It's capped at 175 or rogues until 57. So it's like, oh, okay. Well, the main thing is to be able to go to 75. Seventy-five percent. That's the main yeah. thing. When that. Yeah, yeah. You you have to be two hundred one skill to do that. And it used to, you know, on P ninety nine, at level fifty one, you can hit two hundred one on any pure melee. That's that's not how it was on lot. No, one seventy five is the skill cap until like level fifty seven instead of fifty one. Well, you're gonna get the fungi tunic, so you'll be you be all right. Yeah, I'm not worried about it. But if I get a fungi, it's gonna be on the bunk. Cause then this is my group tune anyway. Definitely don't hate this character, but definitely the second fiddle once I get a get a monk rolling. So. We should have a uh, spawn soon. Oh. You talking about behind this, or are you talking about a... No, uh, the Lord. Oh, yeah. I'm pretty glad we don't have to buy any of that stuff. That way, when uh, Lucan comes out, I'll have the money for a horse. Oh, yeah. I'm really slacking uh, on farming important. I should have a whole lot of flat from the truly, but I just haven't been logging in to do it. I get a free horse, so I'm I'm good. Huh. Is that in oh, yeah. or is that in uh in pop, you know? Looseland. But a lot on live most people didn't have the money for it until pop. I mean the free one from the AA. Uh, it's I don't know if I don't get it until loose Lunar Park. Honestly, I'm not clue. If you look at your AAs right now, you should be able to. See. It'll be under Pop Advance or you know, something like that. If it, if it's pop. Is that a certain class? Can I even look at the AA tree right now? Yeah, you can. If you're using uh, the correct Paladins and, uh, Paladins and Shadow Paladin. Knights. Paladin oh. and Shadow Knights. Because they're that. knights. Yeah, Paladin and Shadow Knights get uh, free mounts. But they don't get the bard speed. From what I understand, they're like pretty fast, but like not like the fastest. If I remember right, it's like a hundred thousand flat or something, over a hundred thousand for the barge speed mount. Or you can just get lucky and get one off Greg. Yeah, there's a couple Good. different raid targets that drop, and there's a white one off of the. Mara Saru or Sanctus Saru, I mean, uh, boss as well. But good luck trying to get that. I'll probably go for DKP. Let people dump their DKP or whatever. So. Hope you're enjoying hanging out with the boys. We got a pop back here. Rooted. I gotta go into work. Not right this second, but it's confirmed. Okay, so we need to start heading out. No. Maybe a little. We'll, we'll wait a little bit longer. 
I mean, unless you guys can just stay if you want, I don't know. Is the green stuff aggro you here in, in lower and upper gut? Can you just run out? It could, because it's probably scowling, ready to attack or whatever. Yeah, it can. I can confirm. So our strategy is pretty simple here, guys. We're, we're watching on the spell tracker the strength and the dex buffs on all of our melees. We are healing, obviously. Um, occasionally throwing a dot out when mana's looking good. Uh, keeping up regeneration on the tank, Nightwatch, and ourselves for cannibalization. And that's about it. Simple as that. Um, Keeping up decks on myself so that when I am doing good on mana, I can stand up and take a couple swings with the the spear and just give us a better chance of actually uh, getting a skill up. Because our we're going to try to catch piercing up. We've been using a mace the whole time thus far, but when we were first leveling up in Inethil Swamp, we did rotate off with a rusty spear just to get the skill up a bit. So it's sitting at like 45 right now. And we might as well get it up, because I do remember on P99 seeing a bunch of shamans face tanking stuff and stabbing it with their pet. But um, I've also heard people like the uh, aggro kiting, where once the shaman gets a pet, they dot up the target and uh, let the pet damage it while the shaman just keeps aggro via the dots and is running away from it. So maybe we don't need to think so much about our skill with the spear but I'd like to get it up so that I could maybe there are certain solo situations where it is viable because I do see a lot of shamans on P99 face tanking and meleeing so maybe in Kunark or Felius we get weapons that make that more viable like the DPS compared to how much damage you're taking is worth it maybe it's something that's only worth it with Topor or I don't know I don't think so, because you don't get Torpor until like 60, right? Wow, this guy's a Shin, which is the higher tier, but he's conning Dark Blue to me, so he's like as low as can be. Hey, yeah, he's Light Blue to me. He's the Runt. But yeah, it'd be nice to get into the hole at some point, get some loam cheaply. Yeah, I've been kind of anxious to get in there as well. Before yeah. Kunark, when <laughs> the golems start being in there. I guess the lower end is 38 and I'm 42. Like, it sounds like charming could happen, but I really think I should wait till 44 when I get my new Tash as well. And how would I know what is 38, you know? Because there's a level variance. So... I think I'd have some trouble in there right now. Yeah, it has I so just... much life. The stuff in there has so much life that I just don't know anymore. Yeah, but if I get 44, 45, maybe get some minus MR gear to give to the pet too. And then uh, if we can get a tank, you know, because they have, there are elementals in the front that are rogues that could be backstabbing. So might be a pretty nice grind. But yeah, for wizard. Yeah, with for that, sure. For wizard with that extra HP, that, for sure. Yeah, I'm thinking like 
if Tom's SK, I think it's like 43, SK, Enchanter, Wizard, and then uh, a Druid for heals might be enough. A, a Cleric would probably be best, though. At that point, you kind of want to complete heal, right? Yeah. Two Druids, though. Could do. Slows. That's the thing with our little friends group. We're really hurting for heals and CC, like I'm the only one who's really got a healer class or a crowd control class. But it is what it is. Could always pick up randos too, I'm sure. It's pretty easy to do. Or, excuse me, you can always make new friends. That's what I should say. <laughs> one day I'll make another shaman, but it's going to be a little bit probably won't make a druid or or a player yeah one day I'll get Sendrith up for sure in fact he's next on the list after the wizard get ports and then get reses Sorry, I nuked. I think that threw you off. No, it's just, I don't know. It's not landing. But there's a blue out here. Let it add. Yeah. Let's kill him. Both of these guys at this table are dark blue. Alright. Let's, let's just fight over here for a second then. Pull him, pull him back a little bit. You don't wanna. See light blue to you, Jessica? Dark blue. Oh wow, he's dark blue to me too. So I guess 24 is still dark blue to you then. Yeah, I think so. I think it takes about 10 levels right now to go light blue. I got a defense skill up. That was... Oh wow. Uh oh. They tried, but we got too much DPS. Come on, Ghoulbane. I feel it. I feel it coming. It's been two placeholders, so we may get lucky. We got two back to back, and then we got two placeholders. Yeah, that's like thinking, like, all right, I've gotten five bad hands in a row, so the next hand I'm definitely getting at least an ace in poker. It's like, nope. <laughs> I've lost double or nothing five times in a row, so I just gotta keep double or nothing. <laughs> it only works on Fallout. You guys ever played New Vegas? No. Never played Fallout of any kind, but I did watch the show. Dude, I I hadn't played video games for years, and I made a new friend in university like junior year and like went to hang out with him and he had an xbox that he wasn't using and he like he was like ashamed i was like hey you got an xbox why don't we play something He's like, oh no i kind of don't play much these days i'm like no dude let's fire it up and then that was just that was it dude fallout he showed me fallout i was like oh my god i'd never heard of it and yeah oh no the first game he showed me was oblivion which is like the everquest version of fallout Elder Scrolls or something yeah it was awesome, dude. And he was always reloading. Like, something happens he didn't like, reload. So I was like, I'm going to do the opposite. Like, no matter what happens, I'm not reloading. And uh, I, ac I accidentally became a vampire. And I was like, shit, I'm stuck as a vampire now. I had, like, I guess I had wandered through a cave, just, you know, looting stuff up, killing monsters, killing some vampires. I didn't even think about it. And when I was in there, I guess one of them bit me, you know? Like, bit my finger or some crap like that. One morning, like, it was like three game days later, I wake up and it's like, oh, the sun is super bright in your eyes. And I try to go outside and it's like, and I'm like, what the heck? <laughs> and that was so cool. It made it so fun. Like, I was trying to be good and I'm like, now I'm a freaking vampire. I have no choice but to, like, lurk around at night and avoid the guards and break into people's houses and drink their blood. No choice. Yeah. Actually, you do have a choice. Like, if you don't drink blood in that game, 
you just get stronger as a vampire, but more susceptible to the sunlight, and also you look more like a vampire, so uh, people start to hate you, like, on sight. But you get super strong and fast if you do that, if you don't drink blood, ironically. Yeah, and then I tried Fallout, it's like... So I'm just playing it again, Fallout Vegas. And there's casinos in Vegas, right? But there's like luck. Luck is a stat you can put points into in the beginning. So if you like crank your luck up, it's affecting your gambling. Bottle caps come out here. Yeah. Then, uh, whatever. Slot machine. <laughs> yeah. Or no, they have. You get chips, and then you exchange the chips back for bottle caps when you play blackjack. I didn't try the slot machine. I forget if it's spitting out straight bottle caps. That'd be interesting, to say the least. Sorry, I don't have a timer up on the Lord. Oh Lord, I have not timed you. I timeth thee not, oh Lord. Oh Lord, won't you buy me a Mercedes? Mercedes Thy respawns are mysterious. <laughs> so I apologize if anybody feels offended by that. I It's not my intention at all. I am a believer, actually. But, um, for better or for worse, I have a more of a playful relationship with him. And I should have more of a sense of ceremony, I think. But, um, he's pretty forgiving, I think, as well. I think formalities are more for our own sake than for his. I don't think he's taking offense as much as we might think. But, uh, long story short, I apologize. I hope you can forgive me. Understanding that I'm not coming from a place of mockery. At least, to some degree, forgive me. Due to that. Yeah, I think conversations died down. We discussed all the stuff there is to discuss. Nice grind, but the video's getting long, so I'm going to pause, and then I'm going to unpause each time we kill the placeholder, or every time we kill the Lord himself. His, you know, the... I didn't mean for that one to sound like scripture. <laughs> but you know what I mean. Congrats. Thanks, man. And it's hard, hard being self-bound. Glad we got that for you. <laughs> yep, looks like Korvac got a ghoul bane. Wink, wink, we're doing the invisible ghoul bane, which means um, we gotta leave, and we don't really want to do this again. So we're gonna pretend like we got the ghoul bane. I don't know, I had a good time. I got pretty good XP. Yeah, me too. I'm almost 26 now. I'm used to high pop. level now, I guess. So this feels good. Pop back here. So yeah, Corvax got a ghoul bane in the bank. We killed the Lord a couple times and a bunch of placeholders. We've been here for a good couple hours. Yeah, I can kill some shit. You know, I've kind of given up on being so strict on the self-found thing. A, you know, it's more just about the adventure. And B, uh, we're playing with our friends. And look at them. He's got full rubicite, you know. These guys are not self-found. So it's kind of like, the self. what well, we're going to be getting out of the self-found from this point forward is coming to camps like this at all 
and we'll be able to showcase, you know, the Ghoulbane camp like this and various other camps as we move forward. I think one of the next spots I want to go to is Permafrost. There's a couple of pieces that would be really good for my Shaman there. And my Shaman being a caster, the upgrades aren't as important, so there's no item where I feel like if we're at the camp for a while and I don't get it, then I'm just going to give it to myself. I don't even have items. Like, my main is a 42 enchanter. I'm not like Wolfdar. He's got a, he's had a 50 druid for a while who's farmed a bunch of stuff. So he's got that stuff just tempting him in the bank, but I don't even have those temptations. So at least for this character, it really will be self-found. Like, I don't have anything on me. I'm using a fine steel spear and a bra shiny brass shield. You know, I don't have anything special on me. And I don't plan to. I uh, need to get the wisdom up at some point. But we will. There's some good pieces in. There's a couple things that will help give me a better mana pool. In Permafrost. One of which is a headpiece. I forget the name of it. But it does 4 intel and 4 wisdom. And another one. Is the wolf fur slippers. Which you may have seen me get on my enchanter. They give like straight 20 mana. So... Start to develop a bit of a better mana pool there. Our mana pool seems alright. Like, I haven't been running out of mana when I'm soloing. Especially now that I got Cannibalize. But I'd like more, and I would like to increase the wisdom for casting skill ups. You guys are uh, reducing fizzles. Now. Yeah, I gotta go. Um, so, um, you guys gonna stay, or are you gonna go? Yeah, we're gonna go. So let's start working our way out. Yep, yeah, we'll start working our way out. Yeah. And then, yeah, Wolfdar said he wants to power level my wizard, so we gotta go. Yeah. Ah. See, he well, said do it. it a little bit if you want to. Yeah, sure, if you do. Oh, shit. I was joking, then I looked at the time. Right, 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 right. I'm like, it's still hey, kind of early. Hey. <laughs> we, we got a lot. Because y'all are talking, and I'm following. CC to the rescue. I got two warriors rooted. Oh well. Oh lord, what was that? Some big nuke? <laughs> Night watch, you're like, I do not want to die again. I do not trust this shaman anymore. Dude, no, it's not even <laughs> that. I have that so much in the past few days. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's I remember insane. your story. Like, that was crazy. I can't believe you lost half a level. That's like, I don't know. I can't imagine how that would happen. But, I mean, I've had I it happen was, to me I once. Like, I was like, uh, he didn't die today. No, I lost half a level yesterday. <laughs> that sucks ass. You know, like, I got, like, res and, like, just died again like three times and miss more and it was awful oh miss more yeah sounds about right was it trains or was it the healer or both no it's just healers like like we had a druid and a shaman and then the druid magically had wife aggro and then he didn't say anything and then the shaman just didn't heal me at all I... So because we paid the clerics to res me, and then I was sitting, and then I was sitting at like no HP, and then I died again because no one healed me, and then we had to repop at the camp. So we're fighting our way out now. Um, Classic's got to go to work, and Jethika's gonna go with him, and uh, I think Nightwatch. He did a mistell. He hasn't said anything to us that I know of, but he did a mistell telling about how he's got some plans later today as well. Oh, he told me yesterday that he's going to come, but he does have a family thing to go to today, some family gathering. So we're on our way out, but we do have to fight our way I out. I can't wait till 30 so I can blow all my mana in like two heels instead of just casting this over and over again. <laughs> right. It felt really nice hitting 39 on the Ranger. That's a 100-point heal we get. It's pretty good, actually. This was fun, and then uh, I guess the next session is going to be Ixars. Ixars.
So I'm going to try to get Wolftar to power level my wizard to 20. Looking forward to I've that. I've got him here. I hope, uh, to hope it goes well. Right. I really have a feeling that if we get creative and don't go to Field of Bone, and I think there's two other zones that actually connect to Cabalus, or is it just Warslick's Woods? There's no, there's also there's Swamp. Four. Right? Four, there's four. Swamp, no Swamp, hope. Swamp, Warslick's, Field of Bone, and Lake of Billow. So I bet Field of Bone will probably be. If Field of Bone, Bone is that's where is cramped, is. then maybe I think Warsaw's Woods might be cramped too. But I think if we get beyond those two, I think we should find something to do. Swamp of No Hope because everybody fucking hates it. But if we're in a group, there's plenty of places that we can go in there. So. I mean, but here's the thing about Swamp of No Hope. There's like level 45 stuff there that's just like around. Yeah. Yeah. But not. You got to get halfway across the zone to level. True. But like the level 16 to 20 stuff that pass through the newbie area, you gotta watch out for it. That's like the one booking that comes through. And at low levels, it's not gonna matter anyway. Because you just run back over there. Yeah. <laughs> The worst part of that is having to run from peel to bone through capitalist. All right, I don't, I don't know how to get out. That's why I'm gonna have to leave. Yeah, I'm not very uh, good at going backwards. Do we go right and go through the warden? Here we go or left, we... right? Okay. Yeah, they're both viable. Go ways. left and go through the fungus. Yeah. It's the only way I know. The warden drops some stuff for rogues, though, but probably nothing better than Jethka already has. Sky dagger. Or whatever. Fucking planer bone saw. Yeah, bone razor for fucking fear. There we go, fun guys. Oh, we're going the right way. Fungus breeder. Right. Last time we were here, I was like, make sure that guy doesn't get on top of you, Corvac. Mm. You know, gonna have yeah. some last, gonna have some Last of Us situation going on. Out. I'm having trouble. Oh, there we go. I guess I'm we too big. Fungus, man. Oh, the breeder's on me. Why did he flame like me? Because he likes you. <laughs> it's that red armor, dude. I forgot to even shrink myself. So we're working our way out, guys. Next video should be XR1, so make sure to tune in for that, because I think that should be pretty fun. I hope. Or frustrating, which, uh, hey. No news like bad news, right? Don't you love watching people get frustrated even more than watching them have a good time? <laughs> Sometimes. So fast.
Yeah, they're green to a lot of this, so they're going to run. And then they get to 50% in one second. Yeah. Almost before you cast near. Really, it's gonna be like this the whole way out. It's like, don't you guys know, like, when not to pick a fight? I mean, is stuff green to you at this point? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's like yeah, yeah. yeah. Sorry, guys. Yeah, I'm not used to that. I'm the lowest level. some point probably when we get the ladder or something we might be able to just book it yeah yeah you, do you need to did you push it that close did they give you a time to get in they probably did for sure no, i was supposed to be there at 10 which is 27 minutes i still gotta like shower but and drive there which is like 25 minutes <laughs> but it doesn't matter like i'm extra so they can suck it or whatever <laughs> Yeah, you told them you had some plans in the morning, so. Yeah, and I told them I'll do what I can. Oh, got aggroed. Rooted one. Pretty much didn't even need to. Jesus. Well, guys, I was going to film the whole way out, but it feels like conversations just about died down. I'll pause until we say our goodbyes. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, Nightwatch fell in the water on the way out, and then he fell in again after he got out of it. I fell in a third time. Oh, gosh, you just... And I'm not doing this on fucking purpose. I am you're, literally... You're tilted. Bad. You're tilted. I, I, I am definitely <laughs> laughing at your expense. That was too fucking good. We're, That's we're why I, 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 I like to put Lev on in here. Oh yeah, I had that. I could cast Lev on you, I think, right? I noticed you can cast Dead Man floating indoors in this on the server. Did you make it? Yeah, I'm out. Okay, okay, I'm coming. Alright, you guys. That's going to do it for this session. Good run. We got the ghoul bane. Wink. No, no wink. Work, <laughs> Thanks. Yeah. Yeah, no. Yeah, that was cool. Yeah, that was fun. See you guys. <laughs>